one of the fashion and design capitals of the world, and certainly the financial and economic hub of Italy. We're in Milan, the second largest city after the capital, Rome. EA7 Emporio Armani Milan tonight play host to the visitors from Russia, Unix Kazan. This is a game of pride, and Milan would not want to repeat of what happened back in round 10 when the two sides last met. Keith Langford bagged a quarter of his side's points with 25, and with Artisan Pukowski, Vadim Panin and Orlando Johnson adding a further 48 points, it's easy to see why Unix broke their club scoring record and the 100-point barrier. Quino Column was pulling all the strings. Unix 2 meter 15 centre Art Pachowski has had a season of consistency with plenty of highs, including 21 points against Fenerbahce in round 19 and 14 points and 8 boards in the loss to Siska in round 28. A key figure for Unix alongside Langford and Column. Last time out for these two sides saw EA7 at Zalgiris trying to halt 13 consecutive road defeats. Behind a great team spirit and 17 points apiece from Jamel McLean and Andrea Cinturini, the visitors managed to hold their nerve down the stretch for their first win in eight. Their 24-year-old guard, Awudu Abbas, was player of the game with three career highs and his six from six from the charity line proved crucial. Unix were on the road too, this time in Belgrade and they led briefly at one point until Zvezda put together a 26 points to three run that sunk all hopes of a Unix road win. Final score, 83 to 65. The loser of this one props up the other 15 EuroLeague teams, so neither side will want to taste defeat. It's the final game at the Mediolanum Forum for this season. It's round 30 and Milan against Unix.